The response that an individual shows to disease is dependent on that person's unique phenotype. Currently, it's challenging to quickly follow whether a person is responding properly to therapy or not. A multidisciplinary team led by Dr. Santos has developed a new tool for tracking patient disease progression and response to therapy. When the body fights disease, the levels of proteins in the body change. For instance, when a tumour is growing, proteins associated with tumorigenesis are released, as are proteins related to the body's inflammatory and immune responses. As the tumour grows, the levels of these cancer-related proteins increase. These protein changes can be tracked using non-invasive liquid biopsies such as urine. The variation of protein levels as the tumour grows are analysed with high-resolution mass spectrometry. Using this method, hundreds of proteins can be identified, quantified and grouped by biochemical pathways using algorithms. These groups are then translated into circles, which indicate the levels of each biochemical pathway through the Personal Pathways Index. Then, by calculating the difference between the levels of each biochemical pathway at different time points, the Differential Personal Pathways Index, or DPPI, is obtained, which can be used to track an individual's response to disease and therapy. If the DPPI is positive, it indicates that a disease is progressing and therefore therapy isn't working. If it's negative, it indicates the opposite and treatment is working. The method is so powerful that it can provide specific information about individual pathways, like cytokine storms, indicating whether therapy is working or should be adjusted. This extremely effective and fast method will not only reduce therapy costs and improve quality of care, but will save lives globally.